just went to Trader Joe's, so I thought I'd show you a little Trader Joe's haul and then probably do like a little Sunday reset together. So let me just show you everything we got. First of all, I got parsley, which I thought was cilantro, so that's my bad. Oats, eggs, avocado, lime. I always have to have potato chips. They're my weakness, and I'm trying this new olive oil kind. Well, it's not new, but new to me. Some black beans for tacos. Vegan Caesar dressing, which is super good because we're going to make some Buddha bowls and use that. Matt got these jerk style plantain chips. Those are also for Buddha bowls. Some miscellaneous veggies. Romaine hearts and arugula. Onion. And oh, I'll show those quick. Matt's about to make these, but we got these gluten free English muffins and I will take one too. And where was that? Cabbage. Frozen mixed veggies for tacos. Some mushrooms. These are our favorite. These Thai vegetable gyozas. So good. Um, some corn to grill out. I already showed that. And then we also got some peanut butter. Matt likes peri peri. Some tofu. Also this soyaki from Trader Joe's is amazing. This is like an emergency meal. We'll split. It's just like the Indian, frozen Indian cuisine and mixed berries for oatmeal, some almond milk. Matt got some salmon, some taco shells, and then Ezekiel bread and gluten-free everything bagels. I think that's it. But yeah, we got all this food for I think like 140 something dollars, which not bad. They have pretty good prices. So I just put all the groceries away. I did a video for this week and now I'm gonna do all the dishes and then I think meal prep. And then probably after that, do the floors, and I have so much to tidy. Hold on, I have to turn this YouTube video off. Okay, so yeah, I think all that's on my to-do list for Sunday, a little Sunday reset, and do some laundry. And then if I get all that done, hopefully I can go and just hang by the pool. <laughs> that's my like motivation to get it done uh, in a quickly manner. So let's get to it. super simple I'm just gonna roast all these veggies and then I'm also gonna make some white rice for Matt and I'm also gonna do some tofu just like air fry it basically I'll air fry all these veggies because it's so much easier and I use way less dishes so I'm just gonna do that do some rice in the instant pot for Matt and then for the tofu I normally just cook it in like buffalo or in like nutritional yeast or just do it in like cornstarch and it makes it a little bit crunchy on the outside. But yeah, super easy and just gonna like meal prep and get this out of the way. Pasadena in July, July, hotter than the sun. I've got a beautiful memory, memory from summer of 21. Well, sir, I heard you, the museum is closed now. meal prep's almost done. I think the only thing left is I'm gonna have to do the floors and counters, but I'm gonna do that later because we're gonna go do a quick run to Ikea, maybe see if there's like a dining room table and chairs, like a little round one um, for our like open space in the living room, and maybe a big plant or something, and any other odds and ends that we need for this place just to make it a little bit more homey. Yeah. So I'm gonna show you a little haul of stuff we got. This was just like a couple dollars, I think. This is a planter because I accidentally bought that Italian parsley. But I'm gonna keep it, so <laughs> just need a planter and I'm gonna keep it outside. And then I got this container to keep our shells in. And I think this was two dollars. And I'm gonna put this on the shelf once we hang it up. But yeah, I've been looking for like a little container for our shells. And we had a bunch in our car, so that's why it already has shells in it. We got this set for the bathroom. Cause I thought it would just go a lot better. Like the ones we have now are like marbly, which I'll still keep. Whoa, so out of focus. 
The ones they have now are kind of like a marble, but I thought this would go so much better and it was 12 or $13. This was a little more of an investment, but it detaches here and this goes on top. So it's a planter and we're gonna keep this in the living room and we got a plant for it, which I'm so excited about. And I'll show you that next. Oh, and that was $65. We got a bird of, par bleh, bird of paradise plant and it was 35, but we used to have one and then we moved and we didn't like have any room to bring it with us. So we just gave it away. So I was happy to get another one and that was 35. And then we got this planter for it, which was like 12 or 13. So this will set, sit inside of this basket, but I'll put it together really quick and just show you what it looks like all together. But I wanted to get like a big plant for our living room because I feel like it needs a little more greenery. <laughs> also, I love this, uh, this like Sunday reset turned into like a little Ikea shopping and haul. And I'm proud to say we didn't get any snacks at Ikea, but I love the veggie dog. It's so good. I just wasn't hungry, so I didn't get it today. And then I forgot, we have one last thing, which is like a small table for out on our patio because currently like the furniture set we had for the patio, like our other patios are bigger. So our table for outside is way too big. So we're just using it as a coffee table. Otherwise it'll just like sit in storage and we'll buy a coffee table later on then. But yeah, so we just bought like a small table to like set drinks on. And that is Oh, hold on, I gotta help Matt. That's the hall though. Anyways, that's the hall. And then I'm just gonna put everything together and show you. Baby, 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 it's plain to see That I get starstruck in your company It's taken a year, but you don't understand How it makes me feel when I hold your hand That looks so cute. I love this plant stand. And I was like hesitant because like it's a little expensive for just a plant stand, but maybe that's the going right, but I love it. Okay, now I'm just gonna switch out the bathroom items. Which I thought this color is like so cute. It's like, kind of reminds me of like sea glass or something. Oh shoot, I think Matt needs help. Do you need help? No. Okay. Super good. Ta-da! And then there's I get the curtains open and there's my swimsuit on the rack, but I think that like the sea blue looks so good. Me right now. <laughs> but yeah, looks good. Yeah, it looks good. It actually matches pretty well. Little update. I just put this little like dining. Well, we're, it's gonna be our like dining table situation for now. And eventually we'll get a new one. We found a nice, really nice set we love from Ikea, but we don't have the space for it. So that'll be like when we buy a home. But we may buy the chairs and stuff first and then get the table later on. But, it's almost six o'clock, so Matt's still putting the shelves up. So I'm gonna get started on dinner because we are both hungry. So I'm gonna make this from HelloFresh, the street cart style chickpea bowls and it's vegan. So I'm gonna put this together and probably once he's done with the shelves, it'll be like we're done for the night because it's already getting late and we both had like really busy days. Dinner is served. These look and smell amazing. So we're gonna dig in and then probably call it a night after that. <laughs> okay, update. Matt hung up this mirror. Here I am. <laughs> and he hung up these two shelves, which I have to still put a bunch of stuff on, but looks good. So 
officially gonna call it a night. I don't think we're gonna do much more. I just might wipe down the counters. Matt's gonna do dishes and then finally relax and enjoy our Sunday evening. I'm gonna call it quits here. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. <laughs>